they're dead. And you must be Midon. He doesn't speak. So I've heard. I'm here to find out why. Chrysis did this to him. Uh -huh. I thought he did this to himself. To prove his loyalty to her. Now, why would Chrysis want an elder priest to cut out his tongue? Midon is a caring, generous man. I want answers from him, not you. Tell me about the Spartan woman and her baby. He can only answer yes or no. I know why Chrysis made you cut out your tongue. The night my mother brought my sister here, you and your priests left her for dead. And Chrysis didn't like you telling the story. That's not what happened! What do you know? You're too young to have been there. He told me the story many times before that witch stole his voice. He tried to save the baby, did everything he could. I don't believe you. Dead. How can my baby be dead? I don't know what to tell you. You were lucky she survived as long as she did. That, that fall was devastating. <laughs> my baby. My baby. <laughs> Listen, there's nothing we can do for you anymore. You'd best be on your way. Ray is here. <laughs> They're gone. They're both gone. He wept for that Spartan woman so far from home. Her baby barely recognizable, hardly breathing. Chrissy should have had your tongue cut out. I want answers from someone who was actually there that night. Chrysis took the baby, didn't she? And she made you cut out your tongue to hide the truth. Where is Chrysis? So now you want to hear what I have to say. Don't test me. Speak. There is an altar where people offer their sick babies to be healed. This is where she took the child. Find it near the statue of Apollo Maleatas and you'll find Chrysis. People come to this sanctuary to heal. But I come here and find people dying without hope. Priests without tongues. And babies left with an insane woman. <laughs> My mother was a fool to trust any of you. I'm going to find Chrysis. And she's going to pay for what she's done. Hush, my child. May Ira bless our sacred family. This is the key to finding my mother. I must find this altar of Apollo Maliatas. There's the statue of Apollo, 
and the altar. Chrysis will find... A warning. Must be getting close. All you cultists will die here! seems to run in your bloodline, almighty oh eagle bearer. Don't you dare speak of my family, snake! I still remember the night your mother brought me my child. The sad, pathetic thing, crying in the rain. Had I known then that Mirini had two children. But here you are. My family is complete. You let my mother believe her baby was dead. But she was. Oh, how your mother wept when that little heart stopped beating. But then I took care of her, placed her on this very altar, screamed for the gods to spare her life, and they listened. I'll run my spear through your throat for the pain you've caused! <laughs> this world is pain! I gave the most strength to go! Your mother was a weakling who whined to the gods like a pig on an altar. I am more a mother to her child than she will ever be. I can be a mother to you too, Eagle Bearer. This goes beyond my family. You and your cult are going to destroy the Greek world. You bring nothing but suffering. You talk of suffering, and yet you come drenched in blood and threaten my life. You are a killer, just like your sister. Here, let me show you. My child! This baby is yours? She was dying. Chrysis had me bring a gift to Ira so that he might be protected. Chrysis lit the temple on fire with the boy and me inside. Chrysis is a servant of Ira. She does what needs to be done. What needs to be done? She left your baby to burn alive. And you saved him. Gods bless you, Eagle Bearer. Sleep now, sweet child. Mater is here. I'm not sure saving that baby was the right thing to do. Rhesus's reign of terror must end. If what Hrisi said was true, Mirini believes my sister died long ago. I can't let Hrisis walk free. 
kill that Malakas. 